everyone. My name is Jessica Liao. I'm the training manager for our Americas region. And today for our tips and tricks video, we're going to cover two topics. The first one is going to be what's new in AE 12.1. The second topic is going to be something that's really beneficial for our active users that not everybody really knows about. And that's going to be the Argus community. And so we're going to see some different ways to get help from our support team and also how to get self-help um, and look at knowledge base articles and videos. So let's go ahead, let's get started within Argus Enterprise and let's talk about some of those new features for our Americas region. The first one is going to be found actually in our valuation parent tab, present value sub tab. So within Argus Enterprise, we have had the ability to have a secondary, secondary discount period um, for a while now. But one of the things that's new in AE 12.1 is we have some new drop down menus and some new options for our secondary discount period. Um, the first one is we do have the ability to change the discount rate for that period. So you can see over here um, towards the right section of our screen that our discount rate is currently defaulting to 12% because that's the same one in our primary discount period. But we do have the ability to override that and enter in a different discount rate. Another new feature that we're going to see is right below that, we also have the ability to change the resale method for our secondary discount period. So in this particular file, I have two different property resales already modeled here. And what we're going to do is if you take a look at that resale method, it will default to the first one that is model. But if I hit that drop down, I have the ability to pick and choose between different resale methods. So those are going to be really two of the main features in our present value tab. Um, the next feature that I want to talk about that's new um, with the 12.1 release is going to have to do with our report doc. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to turn on our inputs as well as our reports and right below that we have our report doc, which is a feature that we've also had in Argus Enterprise um, previously. But when we undock our reports, before Argus Enterprise 12.1, it would just immediately take us to all of our different reports and we could move from report to report to report. But one thing that we didn't have here was our reporting toolbar. So you didn't have the ability to print your reports, export them, or change the report options in the report doc. And now we have the ability to do that. So I wanted everybody to be aware that now our report doc has our ribbon bar and you actually have access to all of those tools from the doc as well. So I'm going to go ahead now. We've talked about two of the main features with the 12.1 release. Um, in order to see any of the other release notes or anything like that, we have the ability to do that through the Argus community. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and show everybody how to access that community. So from the uh, Argus website, um, altusgroup.com slash Argus, we have the ability to go ahead and navigate to the community landing page by clicking on our support tab. So as soon as we click on that support tab, we get to the Argus community landing page. Just directly from this page, we have the ability to access other tips and tricks videos. We have the ability to access different frequently asked questions. Um, we have the ability to email support as well, which will open up a window. Give us the ability, or excuse me, give our clients the ability to go in, say what's going on. You can even attach files and send it to our support team. You also have the ability to access our downloads and different product updates. Um, from our downloads page, you'll have the ability to see release notes um, and different pieces of information like that, all from our landing page. Now, what's great about this is you have access to all of this really without even logging in yet. But I'm going to go ahead, log us into the community so we can see what we have access to within the community itself. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. As soon as I log into the Argus community, we're going to see a brand new page open up. And from this page, we automatically have the ability to go right here, search for different articles and different discussions. You have the ability 
to go in and to actually chat with other industry professionals over different topics. So you can see that we have discussions here and you even have your own feed to see who's responded back. Um, you have the ability as well to search by product right below that. And then you will see up at the top, I have a ribbon where I can see different topics. I can see my own cases as well. So if you have any cases open with support, you have the ability to do that. Um, and go and view those cases and see any updates. We have the ability to see any of our Argus software certified professionals as well and see a full list of them. We have knowledge, which is actually going to be our knowledge base that's full um, of different articles over some of our uh, different products and different topics um, and different use cases. What's great is that we have over 3,000 articles currently uh, in the Argus community. We have different videos that we can search as well. Um, and then we also have some of our documents, some of our important documents such as release notes and items like that. So if I go to our knowledge base, I have the ability to search any of our articles and any of our topics as well. So for instance, if I wanted more information over Excel for ADW, I have the ability to enter in that topic, hit search, and all of the different articles over Excel for ADW are going to pop up. So you have the ability to get in contact with support, get any help you need from a support representative, but you also have the ability to self-help as well and search any topics and get different videos, different articles over those topics. So that is it for our tips and tricks today. Thank you so much.